Hiya, it's Clive from E Outdoor. I'm wearing the North Faces, and I'll probably pronounce this wrong. Why well, they can't give them, these people can't give jackets simple names, I haven't got a clue. Kio Dyad 2 jacket. And you probably all say to me, no, that's not how you say it, which is fair enough. It's not in the name, it's in what it is, isn't it, really? Now this is a, one of the latest jackets from uh, North Face and if you're thinking about waterproof jackets for the coming spring and summer, this one is specifically designed to be lightweight and easily packable. So it is excellent for mountain work, uh, backpacking, where you, you, you want something which is as light as possible packs down easily, gets into your rucksack so you can whip it out when you want. It only weighs about 330 grams, I mean that obviously depends on whether you're large, medium or small. Uh, it is waterproof by North Face's dry vent. Now this is North Face's uh, equivalent to e-vent. Dry vent is, well people say, it is slightly more breathable than uh, Gore-Tex, okay? Uh, the thing about things like dry vent is that you, you need to wash them quite frequently to keep the pores open so that uh, it maintains its, its waterproofness. Can you say that word? I've said it a few times in my reviews. Perhaps I'm inventing a new word, I don't know. Anyway, it's also DWR treated, so frequent washing with, uh, with a good uh, suitable washing detergent and then proofing will keep this in, in good condition wherever you are, whatever you're doing. And when it chucks it down with rain, ta-da, here it is. The whole point of it, I think, it really is its lightweight and its compact ability with its waterproof ability with its breathability so if you're doing you know quite energetic you're hacking your way up a mountain or something then then this is a jacket for you let's run through some of the features what I like don't like it's got a hood which is not helmet compatible well I don't think it is it's got an elastic crown around it which feels a bit strange and it's all sits on your head like a like an elastic crown round here but it, it holds it in place which is which is great uh, there's no cinch cord around the side so you can't pull it in with a cinch cord um, and the peak is is reinforced but it does up quite tightly and obviously there's this leaves this space around here because you can't you can't pull it in at all the zip, YKK, waterproof, with a waterproof barrier behind it. There are two uh, pockets, hand pockets, YKK. Uh, I tried them out and I couldn't get an ordnance survey map in them, so that's a bit of a drawback. And also, when you are got your rucksack on, the waist strap come around here, so you know, it clashes a bit with pockets. I don't know why, anyway, yeah, a lot of jackets are like that these days, aren't they, waterproof jackets. A big plus for it, which they've added this year to it, is uh, side zips ventilation. So like I say, it's, it's designed for active work in the mountains or, or, yeah, hard walking. So you can get plenty of ventilation, one this side and uh, there's one on this side as well. It's got cinch cords down here so you can pull in the, uh, the hem around you. But I've not found a button to fasten it, so <laughs> sort of pull them. They do stay, but I don't know how tight you can get that. But again, maybe you don't want it that tight, you know, if you're... Uh, you, 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 want, you want that kind of ventilation. It's good cover, uh, it, you know, covers around here, so uh, so it does well. So there we are. Um, oh yeah, Velcro hook and loop cuffs.
pretty standard in waterproof jackets. Very simple, very light. It feels quite thin and quite light, but it is up to the job. So, yeah, if, if you're the kind of person that's, that's going to be storming up mountains this year, or you're the kind of person, I mean, like, you, you know, if you were doing a three or four day backpacking trip, I would say this kind of jacket would be great. Excellent, you know, it doesn't weigh much, it's not going to take up much in your backpack, um, and hopefully you're not going to be wanting to do backpacking when it's absolutely throwing it down for ages, time after time after time, or it's extremely windy weather or anything like that. You know, it's going to rain, it might be heavy rain, but it's not going to be lasting, and this would be perfect. So if that's the kind of activity you're looking for this year, this is North Faces, and I'm not going to attempt to pronounce it again. I'll write it across the bottom so you can see for yourself what it says. All right, thanks for watching, and uh, hope you have a good summer, spring this year with some good walks. It's beautiful here <laughs> in these woods. Fantastic day. Thanks. Hope you like it. See you again.